हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम परविंदर रंधावा गुरु यू आर वाचिंग माय यूट्यूब चैनल डेट्स परविंदर रंधावा प्लीज लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय यूट्यूब चैनल अब ऑल सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल दिस चैनल हैज यूनिक कंसेप्ट यू नो एंड वी दिस चैनल हैज ऑल्सो एडिड वन थिंग डेट इज टेस्ट प्रोडिक्शन विच आर बेस्ड ऑन पास्ट रिसर्च वर्क and these predictions are almost accurate so let's start this is listening video in this video i have selected mcqs from cambridge official guide the uh, right and the questions are 21 to 26 so as i sold the recently this video in hindi version or i am trying in english also so that the english speaker they will also get benefit about my techniques and tips the thing is that that in this video what i want to say that there are two male members now because there was one question first of all thanks to all people who are com- giving very nice comments and because their comments are always from their heart that i know so i appreciate those people right so and now let's come to the point because in this video i have selected section 3 this is a section 3 as i have already solved it please right so i have selected section 3 that is uh, conversation between mr dev and randeer so and how they solve the means how to solve when two male members are there and this test is uh, that is of test 1 uh, cambridge official guide okay so that's a book of cambridge and cambridge material is the best you know for ielts so let's start right so please first listen and i have written the things whatever i noted because whenever i do mcq i just try to write so that i can get my accurate answer right so i will do a dummy uh, now again on this sheet because i don't want to change the sheet even if i have one more sheet but the thing is that some things are written and i want that you should use this also so let's start please right for student admissions to the college and i use a computer system to help process student enrollments and to do the time tabling uh-huh. but it really doesn't suit the way we work these days it's over 10 years old and although it was fine when it was first introduced it's just not good enough now okay what problems are you experiencing Well, 20 years ago, the college was quite small and we didn't have the numbers of students or tutors that we have now. So the system can't handle the increasing volumes. Well, there's a lot more data now and it sometimes seems the system has crashed, but in fact, it just takes ages to go from one screen to the next. Right. Is that the only problem? Well, that's the main one, but there are others. In the past, doing the timetabling was quite simple, but now we have a lot more courses, and what's made it complicated is that many of them have options. Right, but the system should allow you to include those. Well, no, it doesn't. It was supposed to, and a few years ago we did ask someone from the technologies department to fix it but they never seemed to have the time hmm are there any other issues with the system well i've been given extra responsibilities and so i have even less time to do the time tabling if there was anything you could do run dear to make the process more efficient that would be really helpful well it sounds like you could do with an assistant but that's obviously not possible so what about having an online system that students can use to do their scheduling how would that work well it may mean less choice for students but we could create a fixed schedule of all the courses and options 
and they could then view what was available and work it out for themselves. That sounds great. Okay, so um, we'll need to decide whether or not to improve the existing system or to build a completely new system. Well, I'd much prefer to have a new system. Quite frankly, I've had enough of the old one. Okay, that'll probably take longer, although it may save you money in the long run. When were you hoping to have this in place? Well, it's January now, and the new intake of students will be in September. We need to start processing admissions in the next few weeks, really. Mm, well, it will take more than a few weeks, I'm afraid. As an initial estimate, I think we'll be looking at April or May to improve the existing system, but for a new system, it would take at least nine months. That would be October at the earliest. This is about the test. Right, in this test, the things are clear. And let's discuss this one. Because as I told you that I have already solved in Hindi language. So now I am trying to do in English. So the thing is that first is Dev. So he clearly mentioned that who is Dev because they both greeted one each other. Then he said that uh, it uh, means previously the systems were fine. But nowadays it's already 10 years. So it right very uh, means I uh, just like we can say that become outdated 10 years old. Now the main problem we are both agreed so that's why I wrote here right and according to Dave that the system crashed so but they said it stops working right so that's not a thing because the main problem is based on the ages from one screen to another screen he said that's the problem that's only no he that's the main problem so that's why it's too slow. In 23rd timetabling, so they gave the very right and simple option to you. There is no need to discussion also, right? Because they said that the system does not handle course option. And regarding 24th, to solve the timetabling issues, Randhir suggests that the students, they should create their own timetables and they should do themselves. So that's also a direct, so no need to check here. So it means 23rd and 24th, they are simple instead of puzzling. And from this uh, point, Randhir uh, point start, his language started, his speech started. So we have to concentrate on this one. Then he said new system, it may be cost effective. So that's why this is C is the point here. And regarding this one, they said that in Jan, this is Jan, then it will take few weeks to admission, then new system will be in September, but we can improve the because here I have to concentrate only on the existing system. This is the main difference between 25th and 26th. In 25th, the concentration was based on new system. Here, the concentration was based on existing. So. If you forget this one, if you don't, do not highlight this one, naturally your answer might be wrong. So remember this thing. So this is all about this test. I told this is Cambridge official guide test one section three and I did in front of you and you are watching my YouTube channel. That's Parvinder Randhava Guru. Please subscribe this channel. Please like, comment and share my YouTube channel. That's Parvinder Randhava Guru. Right. And wait for the next predictions also which are based on the research part. So hope for the best and best of luck for the people who are going to appear uh, today that is on Saturday and second and please one thing also there is in, there will be no change in 2021 right I will go on similar basis so once again I say please subscribe my YouTube channel thanks once again for watching this video.